It's a chow show. This is Callistus, faced with a fine flavored afang soup and a mountain of semu. But first, he must cleanse his weapon in the purest of waters. Why? Eh, because it's part of the ritual. And now, he sweeps in, taking a clean cut while looking at the soup, letting it know who's boss. He molds the piece of semu with clinical precision only the likes of a Shaolin master can employ. He dips in, and with one awesome gulp, he is able to relish. Afang soup originates from the south-south region of Nigeria. It is known amongst the Akwaibom and Cross River people. It is made with okazi leaves, water leaves, assorted protein, and any seasoning of your choice. Now, watch his hand movement closely. Our hero continues his fight of mouth, throat, and stomach, believing that just like Nelson Mandela, he too can overcome. Watch the professionalism, the tenacity and skill he uses in molding that innocent swallow. One might ask if this can be thought. But anyway, let's just admire the courage that Callistus has to face a delicate delicacy such as this. Now he is ready to go for the kill. Observe diligently. Picking up a piece of goat meat on his plate, he weighs it. Why? Hmm. Story for another day. He bites into it. And with that, he can tell if the goat was male or female and the level of seasoning it was marinated into and even if the goat had sense. And so he bites. And bites. And, um, swallow? I guess we can call it that. Now, let it be known that the Semo has not been forgotten. Hmm, he's able to bring down this mountain. It hasn't been easy, I must tell you. But now, he's saying deep to himself that instead make food waste, make belly bust. But how long can he hold on to this fight? Oh wow! Look at this one. Ace, hey, Callistus! <laughs> Finish what you started, son. Fight the good fight and make us all proud. If you haven't tried this before, try today.